Hi guys, thank you so much for watching. I'm Dr. Linda Kramer. So the question today is, how are you feeling the last two weeks? I'll say about the last two weeks, because I'll tell you where I'm at. This has been a very, very busy time for me. However, there are days when I just feel like running. You know that feeling when everything just seems overbearing, you got information coming from all these different sources and you're just like, ah, I want to run away. So today I want to talk about this because when we're trying to be spiritual, we're trying to be positive, we're trying to be loving and supporting all the time, okay? Our vibrations way up here with all our crystal singing bowls and our tinchy bells and we're doing all our ohms and raising our vibration exercises. But guess what? Energy is constantly changing, okay? We can never stay at that top high vibrational state. So that's why we get days when our energy just goes, Ear! you know, like the coyote falling off the cliff when the roadrunner's chasing him. We jump off the cliff and it's like, bang! And we go into this deep, dark place of, oh my God, I can't keep up with it all. So this is my suggestion, guys. Always be aware of your energy, yes? How are you feeling is one of the questions that I ask myself about 10 times per day. I'm constantly saying, where's my energy at? Am I happy? Am I sad? Am I hungry? Am I full? Am I tired? Am I whatever am I feeling? Okay, because we cannot always be 100% on the game all the time. Okay. So when you do feel that energy depletion coming in or you're feeling that overwhelming feeling or just simply you will want to give up and run away, hide under a rock type place, that's when you've got to listen to yourself and go with it. I'm honest. When you have those moments where you just want to think, oh my God, I just want to go and hide under a rock for a few days, do it. I did that two days last week. Now, I've done about 11 readings last week, but I still managed to find time where I separated. I stopped thinking about everything going on. I stopped thinking about the politics. I stopped thinking about food additives, chemtrails, fluoride in water. I forgot all about that. I switched off to everything and I concentrated just on me. So this is where we go. Close your eyes. And we feel ourselves. Right now I'm feeling my hair coming down my head. The, pardon me. Then we feel our shoulders. We feel our arms and our fingers. I need moisturizer on my hands today. I'm feeling now my hands are dry. Then we feel our torso. We feel our hips, our thighs going down through our knees and toes. We feel ourselves. How do I feel? Well, my hands are dry, I need moisturizer, but I'm full. My hair could use a wash. I need a shower later because it's only early still. But you know what? I feel content. So we come to a conclusion of how we feel. And if you ever do feel anything less than mediocre, that's where you need some time out. And it's okay to say to people, you know what, I told you I was coming, but I need to reschedule. Or it's okay to say, I can't take you there today. Sorry, find your own way. I've got to do things for me today. And that is okay when we say, I need to do things for me today. Self-care is always number one. So coming up to the silly season, where emotions, family feuds, friend feuds, you name it, feuds are always on the cards. This is a time to think about who you are, what you believe in, and what you decide to do with your own time. Okay? Always put yourself number one. That's my advice for right now. Okay? So as we go through these next couple of weeks, it's okay to say, I'm going to go and lie down now. And guess what? I just might do that. 
So on that note, you guys all have a great day wherever you are. Think about what I've just said. Don't let others diminish who you are. Okay? Everyone's going to opinionate it at Christmas. There is always something that irks or frustrates us. So separate. Go back within yourself and say, does that other thing really matter? And the answer is always no. Talk to you all soon. Love you all. Bye.